A non-governmental organization, International Alert, has reiterated the commitment of the organizations towards peace, stability and development of Nigeria. The group's country director, Dr. Paul, made this known during a media parley at the organization's head office in Abuja. Our correspondent, Fumilola Ademi, has details. According to a report by next year, Nigerians' violent conflict database recorded 11 violent incidents across eight Nigerian states between the 7th and 13th of July 2024. Country director of International Alert explained that the group has established various projects and strategies towards initiating and sustaining peace and harmonious existence between worrying community in some parts of the country. We are expanding our work stream uh, to outer areas. We've also recently gone into climate peace building work. We're doing that in Benue and Sokoto. And there's a lot of you know, impact that that project is having. Uh, it's a peace building climate change project that has three outcomes. And those outcomes, one is around building social cohesion. That's what we're about. Um, secondly, is around dealing with the impact of climate change. As we are aware, climate change is increasing tensions and competition among occupational groups in different areas. The third objective is increasing income. Uh, we call it prosperity. Dr. Paul, while commending the media on their role in promoting national peace and security, called for more synergy between the international alert and the media towards achieving more. Whatever interventions that different actors are taking forward in different parts of the country, whatever policies are being made at the governmental level, how do these policies do no harm? And what contribution are they making to peace and stability across the country? Uh, so the conflict and security facility, which is related to you know, the events that we are hosting this week, would aim to have coordination meetings, would aim to analyze the root causes of conflict in the country, and would also promote joint interventions by different stakeholders. The media panel is coming ahead of a two-day workshop on addressing partners of violence, injustice, and criminality in the society. It will be bringing together commissioners and advisors on security to state governments across the nation, most especially the troubled states. Fumilola 